So right now we're at McPherson Square trying to reoccupy the park. Currently we are making signs. Nancy's standing here right now making sign. All right. I have no viewers right now, so it's not that important. Huh? I have no viewers right now, so. Oh, okay. Yeah, I just went up a minute, 35 seconds ago, so. Oh, yeah. Don't worry, there's no one watching yet, so. Watching yet, so. Why would you do that? Why would you have that kind of music? Yeah. Want to dance to. And you don't have to actually know how to dance. dance just, have to the just have a seizure. Yeah, you just like basically like, there's like a bunch of flashy lights and you're just like, yeah! It's still in the past. Oh, man. Hi, Dad. Don't worry. Oh, they hit the ground store. That's what you're going to have to do with the radical. <laughs> Yeah. That's what you do with your spare time. Uh -huh. And what happened? The donation box. Yeah. That's what happens with the donation. 
How you doing? Well, it's the constitutional law and parks. You can have a 24-hour vigilant, and they're not supposed to be able to put you out. Yep. Okay? And I've got a book on constitutional law, and it says exactly Of course, I tried to show it to one of the occupiers who was in the information thing, and their concept was, you know, take that book and put it back in the library. And I had to tell the bitch it was my book. Whoever was in the info table says, like, hey, you need to put that book back in the line there. But it's like, no, it's my book. Yeah, seriously. Yeah. yeah but he's cool with us, so. Yeah. Yeah, that's cool. I mean, like, he has, like, thought, no one can get a So we're good. So when did you start live streaming? I started live streaming about. Two weeks ago? Oh my gosh, Three weeks ago? Baby, you're a baby. Oh, but I got a good event on live streaming though. It was my first real big event. Which was one? um the home eviction. Oh, awesome. I was the only live streamer there. And I got pretty much all of it on footage. The only thing I wish I got on footage was um them knocking out Mark. Uh -huh. But I did not get that, unfortunately. So we're still painting signs, there's no one watching, but whatever. What? I'm just talking to my phone, so when I save it for later, it has some commentary on it. Yeah, so how did it lie? I, I still don't understand it. I mean, like, do they get saved somewhere, or do you decide what to save and what not to save? Um, you save it yourself. So, like, there's a button after you save. Hello, viewer. Please talk to me. See, tell me how the stream is going. One viewer. Okay. But yeah, you decide when to save. There's a button after you stop. Um, it and you can. It says save or not to save. Oh wow. But. It gets published. What? I, there are certain websites that you start an account with, and then it goes to that website. Like, I've been using Ustream, luckily, because Bamboozer has bad video, apparently. Uh -huh. Which, I have an account with Bamboozer, it's like fully upgraded, but whatever. It has bad video. So, if I go to Ustream, that's where I find the video. Yeah. Live streamer. Okay. Yeah. Remember when you were in Chicago? Yeah. That's how I was keeping people abreast of what's going on on Ustream. And it was like, somebody had a live, that I could see it in his eyes. Oh, my God. Yeah, I was watching Carlisle's. When shit went down. Wow, Hello, viewer. Please tell me how the footage is. That's awesome. So we're here right now with Nancy. She's painting the sign. Getting her Nancy. the base coat. <laughs> She's preparing the sign to get painted with words and everything on it right now. We're at McPherson Square. Unfortunately, all the tents got taken down about a week ago. On... T Tuesday, park police came. Actually, a week from today is when all the tents got knocked down the first time, so. Right now, it's just leaving some signs and everything. We are actually getting ready for a big action. 
But we're not telling yes. Right? We're not telling yes. This is just like the <laughs> first, first baby step. <laughs> Don't worry about <laughs> <laughs> So you guys have to keep, um, um, you guys still have to like, uh, <laughs> yeah, just keep in touch. Keep Make in sure. Touch. Follow us. Follow, Follow us. us. Follow <laughs> us. One of us. One of us. <laughs> and, uh, and you will know. I mean, we post this gathering just last night around like 9 p.m. And we're actually amazed that people responded to the action because we weren't expecting anybody. To be honest with you, it was basically just like three people, four people trying to get together and just like have fun at the park and letting everybody know that no one can make decisions for anybody. If you make a decision of taking down the park, you're going to have to talk to everybody. Uh, and yeah, basically today we're going to be having a meeting around 6 in the afternoon and right now we're just getting the things ready. So. Anarchy A. Oh, you guys. Hi there. <laughs> we are Occupy DC. Pardon? We are Occupy DC. Oh, you're occupying DC. Yes. What's, what's that all about then? <laughs> what is it? <laughs> yeah, what is Occupy DC? Occupy DC is a movement, uh, a non hierarchical movement uh, that lets people make a for themselves, and that's how the community is built around <coughs> horizontal organizing. That's one of the principles. It's about uh, speaking our mind and challenging the system and expressing our discomfort and also bringing alternatives to see if we can change. Um, so that's all these tents we see about the town then? These, these tents? These is that what that's all about then? Is it? Yes, basically when we used to have the tents here at the park, it Until was... Until Tuesday. Uh, it was what? Until Tuesday. Until Tuesday. Uh, <laughs> uh, it well, was... Tuesday. Park police came and took everything away. Okay. Yeah, and... Uh, but the good thing is that uh, we're not going away. Okay. Today is Sunday and we're here. And this is just like a small, very small beginning. <coughs> Get to mention Wall Street. Oh yeah, Wall Street, Wall Street. That's the beginning of the occupation. You right? I know. I hate you, man. <laughs> what did I do now? He kept trying to remind you, and you, you just kept rambling on. Oh my God, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Get the fuck out of here. Oh shit. <laughs> We're on live stream. I don't know. What's up? What's up? <laughs> we got witnesses. Go, 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 go. Yeah, right? Man, this I want a pot pie, time. woman. Go give me a pot pie. <laughs> what do you mean, go give me? Like, what is that way of talking? No. This is a safer place. This is a safer place. Okay, I'm leaving. I'm leaving. <laughs> <laughs> Like one cop that show up, but he was like a he's right over there. Cop. There's a cop right there. Yeah. But he's not going to do anything. He glanced over here and just kept going. <laughs> but now he's turning to uh, Earth. Neither am I, but. Yeah. Right? That would be pretty awesome if it comes over and just smashes. <laughs> <laughs> Not my sign! Well, they don't have jurisdiction right here anyway. It's all federal right here. Oh, yeah, you're right. So, who will be the only ones that can actually do something? The park police? Park police, yep. Yeah. Barack Obama himself. <laughs> <laughs> Who's Barack Obama, man? Hello, second viewer. We're here right now in McPherson Square painting signs. 
for the reoccupation. <laughs> Obama is gonna come and be like, oh, people, people, you are okay doing this here, but when I say you go, you better go, I'm just gonna get upset. And his face is gonna change to something else. It's like a real Obama. You know what is that? It's like an ass thing. Yeah, there you go, that's a face. You're not getting it. You're not getting it. <laughs> Who are you going to be voting for? I'm going to vote Clint Eastwood. Yeah. <laughs> the actor? Yeah. Clint Eastwood, 2012. Ask me the fuck Clint Eastwood is. No, I didn't hear. What the fuck do you mean you live in this country? I don't hear. <laughs> 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 what the fuck do you mean you live in this country? Hey, be nice. I'm going to attack you with my yellow cape. <coughs> okay? What's up? What's up? <laughs> Oh, oh, he's getting the straight. <laughs> yeah, no, um, actually, we're not going to be voting for anybody, you know? Because I, I just don't believe. Yeah. I don't believe in Republicans. I mean, That's exactly how I feel. That's why I'm voting Clint Eastwood. There you go. One lie, and the other one lies too. Voting for me. Yeah, so fuck that. <laughs> okay, so how many lies? In the Obama campaign, we can recall by this point. Shit, hon. <laughs> uh, she said uh, the troops are going to be coming back to home. Bullshit. Bullshit. Didn't happen. Hello. They got sent to Afghanistan. Yeah, yeah. He said that he is going to take care, you know, of the affordable housing. Not much, man. Okay, man. Yes, bikini bottom. I love bikini. Yeah, the pink bottom. over there and the yellow here. Look at this pink one. We need Squidward. Where's Squidward? Where'd you need him? Come on, come on. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. 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 Yeah, um, that's same... the same. Let me show you the library. So we're making a sign for the library, the people's library. Don't leave it overnight. The no, is going to tear no, this shit down. Yeah, it's like, that's exactly. Those signs, yeah, but this one, no. Here, so far. Craig okay. is my neighbor, but he smokes something that makes him happy. I know, I know, I know. He's my neighbor, but I can't really know if he's dumb as a brick. So like, later, oh. around 2 or 3 in the afternoon, we're going to be bringing books from uh, the office outside I came from the office. The to the office public. Is actually nice and set up. Yeah, that's good. I've only been there two times. I show people there, but I've never seen it fully. There's five computers in there. I can yeah. boot up. I can charge my shit. You the, get on their computers. You the can only share problem, Wi-Fi their phone lines. The only problem is that you have to call somebody to get in. That is. After a certain time. After yeah. a certain time. It's okay. I am, I, like I said, I never go. I'm usually doing something. But if yeah. I, I stop by and I see the longest I spend there is Mountain Dew there. I have Mountain Dew. I see there's a refrigerator with noodles. There's a kitchen. There's three offices. There's an office room with a conference table. That shit is ridiculous. Thank you, SEIU. $4,000 a month. Y'all have shit. Actually, I say, no, thank you. $4,000. I would appreciate if you can give housing for my people. No shit. You're giving yeah. it to these homeless hippies that should get jobs. But I love it. I like your style, though. Oh, you're just giving more no, room for people to open their laptops and see their asses. You know what I'm saying? Now they can sit there. Now these motherfuckers are sleeping in a tent. You know these motherfuckers are sitting in a suite. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> they sleep outside. Of course they're going to post stuff in here. So, if it rains, you're like, what's up? <laughs> yeah, right? Whatever. I'm going to Warcraft, motherfucker. I just spent <laughs> like 35 people, motherfucker. Thank you. <coughs> I can go to the bathroom now? Okay, thanks. Just don't lock the key in the bathroom. Because I have this place. Okay. Yes, I'm saying how people don't 
know, whatever. But it's awesome. Okay. It's, it's really okay. important actually to have a very public space for people to get educated uh-huh. because then it's going to stay around us, among us. Yeah, because it's not no for, it's now occupied, it's now left apart, <laughs> it is now in every one of your fucking homes. It's been widespread all over the world. But guess what? From Japan to Saudi Arabia to Pakistan yeah. to Brazil to Peru, the North Pole, South Pole, everybody yeah. came to this park on February 4th. And guess how we got it? How did we do it? With an office? No, we did it to be on the street. Because people were able to see us. They were able to listen to us. And a red bandana. They said, we will let you stay here for a little bit as long as you do one thing. Never fuck with this soldier on top of this horse. And they said, really? Watch this. Who said that? Who said that? Whoever put the tarp up. That's what I'm saying. Oh. We put a tarp over that motherfucker. That's an occupied. I don't put it up, so I must be part of it a little bit. Put a fucking anonymous mask on his face and a red bandana on his right front foot. That was going hard as shit. <laughs> Every TV station around the motherfucking block. Wait. That was awesome. Oh my was gosh. I remember awesome. that. There was music, people partying in the streets, spectators coming out of the buildings, looking from rooftops, people driving by, stopping, getting out. Yep. Oh my god, it was ridiculous. And now photographers everywhere. And now and now it's coming back. But what, We're what coming back. Do you think how many colleges back. came down here because this was part of their history yeah. paper? This was real time shit, yeah. current event. And you could not, not get an A on this. Yep. So this is history in the making. So they got to put that shit down on paper. A, A, anybody came to Catholic University, Georgetown University, DW, Howard. Black colleges, white colleges, yeah, you dead, that's my fucking Yeah, I'm going to Marshall University next year. Yeah, I heard everybody had wow. some information. My daughter thought she was fucking great, Dad. Somebody How did your in. daughter find out about Occupy the City? I told her she thinks I'm a fucking king. So why from I don't think I'm a fucking dumb test for this Okay. But that's okay, because my daughter loves me, and that's all that matters. Me and my wife are like But it's cool. We agree that we love our children. Or that we hate our children. That we should hate them. They're going to go big motherfuckers, man. They make Oh no. I don't so I asked her. I asked her for her iPad. Can I touch it? She was like, fuck you, Dad. This is mine. You bought it for me. I was like, Oh my gosh. Why you gotta go like you got Because her mother told me she was gonna do that. She's like, I dare you to ask her for that iPad. She's not letting that go. She calls it her human baby. Uh, oh like, my god, that's so scary. I'm and then one hour later, she's like, Dad, can I have your credit card number so I can download iTunes? Uh, fuck you. Remember that one time you said fuck you? Fuck you back. <laughs> okay, we're here to talk about Occupy UC. How do you feel about Occupy UC? Why you love Occupy UC? I'm going to tell you what Occupy UC is to a homeless person. It's like a utopia starship landed on top of these people. And then they woke up one day and said, What the fuck is this? I've never had this in my life, and it comes to me now. I don't even have to get up. All I have to do is put this blunt out, roll out of my tent, go to the kitchen, eat, and go back to sleep. Yeah. Or every day. I can get drunk as I want. I can get high as I want. I can have sex if I want. I can do anything I can do in a house, I can do out here. So the homeless people, they only care about getting in line five times. I'm like, shit, can I have some more? Can I have some more? Did y'all give up some more? Can I just have some more until this nut left? I'll be back for Thursday, fourth, and fifth. Can I have, this is the best part, when it comes to the line of the homeless ones, can I have dark meat instead of light meat? Because you really think that you lost the market. That's how well I'm supposed to get you paid. It was specifying their meat. Yeah. I don't have a breast and a wing. What? <laughs> Why are you doing this line? I don't understand. You don't have any vegan options. Fuck you fried chicken. You don't have any options. You eat it and you keep moving. There's 20 people behind you. Everything low cost. Oh, low cost. <laughs> you have sugar-free. Stop it. Stop it. You have sugar-free soda. What? <laughs> oh, baby. No, baby. You know, you know what it means. Day. You know what it means for, for for me at least to have a public open kitchen for the homeless, for occupiers, for everybody that shows and people. And you can tell anybody. You can turn anybody away. No, exactly. I look at people with the head That's in my the thing. About, you cannot turn, can't anybody turn anybody away. away because we're here for them, and they were here before us. And we enforce us all to be together and be a community. Yeah, because then we would be form a, a community. The reason we are here is to not become the 1%. To do that, to turn somebody away, would be rejected in the same way we are yeah. out here as the 99%. And she said Everybody it. Everybody comes through 
bother me no matter what. So if you want three pieces of chicken, I'll look at you like, come on, man. Sure, just keep it moving. I can't tell you no. This shit is free. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So I can't. I'm not the boss of you. I wish you could get up and clean the park when I get up and clean the park sometimes, but you don't even have to do that. Just to see me. Maybe you'll follow me, by example, later. Pick up just that 40 or that... Hi, Bob. What occupies you see? Clean the back of yourself. Don't leave it right, right, right here. Throw your trash away and everybody will be happy. <laughs> but if you got a bottle of four locos, just put it in your pocket. Don't leave it in the porta potty. Or at least put it in the porta potty. Don't leave it right there. You can drive by. They say four locos. What do they occupy? Occupy four locos? No, we don't occupy four locos. But we have to get rid of the elements this year. That don't make them throw it away. I'd rather just throw it away myself. Yeah. But this is colorful. This is like fucking Easter. <laughs> Easter at McPherson. And this is just a really small action. Guys, wait up what we have in a store for you in a few months. Oh my gosh. This is like the board. This is exciting because we didn't even make a huge call, but what is coming? What? What is coming is going to be so good. It's like Fast and Furious. Hey! Hey! Oh. Happy Mother's Day. I'm back. Oh, happy Mother's We need some help. <laughs> what? We need some help. All right, I'll be back. No, you're going to park. Hey, happy Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day. I'll be back. Come on, come on. Hey. Come on. You look very shiny. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Shiny. He's hanging out with this lady. She's so awesome. I love her. Is she an awesome lady? No, no, no. He just, he just looks really happy. <laughs> I'm very happy for her. Very yeah. He's not awkward. You see, I met so many beautiful, Occupy. wonderful Occupy people. Occupy is dumb, man. Everybody is dead. Yeah. With Occupy, you see, it's like amazing. Yeah, yeah right? Occupy. You know, oh, one Occupy. thing that I forgot to tell you. Occupy is over there. Occupy. <laughs> Very impressive. Good stuff. One thing that is really complex is that he did force, and I say force like this, he did force some people that will never thought or think about getting, you know, getting close to a homeless person and understand their lives, listen to them, force them to these kind of people, collaborate, coexist with the homeless community. Yeah. That's what it was having occupied D.C. Yeah. on the street. And very well-off people, people that make more money than me, were actually leaving their homes to come here and leave California to come to this state. Yeah. So in Florida. Yeah. Well, because, like, mothership of occupiers for the longest, because we happen to occupy two streets away from the White House, which is at the political epicenter of the world. That place I've seen one of the longest in the encampment in D.C. Of the occupied women, they say it cost $400,000 to renovate this park last year. And they're getting ready to do it again. They actually blamed it on the occupiers and said they were really fucked up this year. And we did not. Yeah. And you brought in your 15,000 oh troops from New York and your so 10 cool. horses and your SWAT team and your helicopter and your biohazard team and extra cops with shields. A gun so fucking big, I thought I was playing fucking World of Warcraft. There's no guns in World of Warcraft. It was like, it was like Call of Duty out this fucker, man. And that's bullshit. There are guns in World of Warcraft. Hunters use them. What? I'm not a nerd. <laughs> Three blocks that way, seven blocks that way, four blocks that way, six blocks that way. We rescued it from the garbage, and look what it's turned in. A beautiful piece of art. That's fucking gorgeous. That is and so that beautiful. is the anarchist symbol, that is genius. Oh, thank you. That's fucking awesome. So tell you how many viewers we have. None right now. <laughs> no, <I'm dead. laughs> I had I had three at most. Happy Father's Day. If it applies. Oh my gosh! What what are they? What are you doing? What are you doing? It was so beautiful before. I think it still is. I Man, it's so beautiful. He's giving me just a little bit of.
Yes, yeah, now it looks like it's moving at the speed of light. <gasps> okay, anyway, so I was I was telling you that um, this reminds me to the few pieces that were left here that a friend of us, uh, a friend of us, um, our friend, Sad Mason, uh, worked on. Mm -hmm. And they were so beautiful and so cute. That's pretty bad. And also, mm -hmm. I'm remembering the committees that used to be at this park. You know, we had the media committee. The media tent the, was there, but the it moved. There was one there. A lot of things we moved. Got the we got torn down. We built, torn down. We the built. kitchen. They tore down the information tent, and the another one was back up tent. in 90 minutes. They had the another one here. Tent. Mo came in 90 minutes, yeah. and we put up a bigger, better information tent than the one that they see in their yeah. fucking face. By the time they got Georgia downtown, because they locked her ass up, they got back, and there were more people down here than they left, and they had a bigger problem. They tore down a little shrub and came back into the fucking street there. Fucking Jeep Cherokee. It was like a four hundred dollars. Yeah. It was up. Everybody came from all four corners. Of the <laughs> Olivia, please tell me how the video is. That is awesome. Just like a week ago, they tried to kick us out of the park, and now we're back. We're back. We're back. That's it. They took all our signs. Like Jason. They took everything and they took back. Took everything from freedom. Took everything from the Every single thing. They printed last week. Occupy DC goes out with oh, like Actually, that was two weeks ago, I think. Yeah. That was with the home eviction. That's why. Yeah. I laughed at that because we got our I people got, that. people's ass got That's beat like up by the U.S. Good. Marshals that day because we were defending a house. Mm -hmm. I saw a Lash on June 6th back being arrested from occupying one of those houses. Well, he didn't get arrested. He didn't get arrested, but his back was shown. Oh yeah. Yeah, I was there live streaming so on that event. To beat the same person twice that you just paid, bro. Ah! Don't pay, bro. <coughs> you mean? 